What's going on, agents? Ask Adam here. Part three of the TU5 skill testing. If you watched my last video right at the end, I had a <laughs> breakthrough on something I wanted to test yesterday before all this came about. I was thinking Monday before any of this came out. So I kind of threw that to the wayside. But <clears throat> my thought was, sorry about that, yesterday morning I was going to post a video and end up not because it was the 4th of July but it was about the hardwire gear set the mortar turret the sniper turret and the bomber drone and m juggling those to keep the cooldowns well we don't need to juggle cooldowns anymore but if I look at my mods now 30 extra sniper ammo that's gonna take the sniper ammo to 45 20 extra mortar rounds. That's going to take the mortar rounds to 30. I got to try it out. I have to try it out. So I'm skipping the intro on this video since it's part three. You guys don't need to see that anymore. You don't need to hear me talk about any, any of that stuff. So let's get right to it. Don't have the mortar because I they spec you into specialist to start with, or survival to start with. So let's go with the sniper. Let's mod this baby up. 148 damage, 148 damage. Oh, no, nope, here. Nope, that is damage. That is duration. Hmm, are we going to lose? Duration still. Three sixty. That's plenty. I have forty five ammo. I, I'm a little excited about this because you know it's one of those things that people don't use very often. So I'm interested to see how this is gonna work. What should I pair it with? Blind maybe? I've got seventeen second blinds. Let's do it. That's gonna be awesome, I think. Hopefully. <clears throat> All right, let's give it a go. You're going to need to get the access codes to the vault to recover the item the hyena stole from Air Force One. Our hyena insider says whoever is posted in the old CEO's office will have a key card that should give you access to the vault. So I just killed myself with the gloves. If you're not aware, the gloves put a status effect when you put a status effect on the NPCs. And I've done that now, oh, I don't know, four times? Five times, maybe? Slow and steady wins the race, I guess. Man! This is way more fun. <laughs> okay. That was too much fun. Wow. Now, that just had me thinking the implications in PvP. I don't know how that's going to affect PvP, but I can tell you that's a lot of fun in PvE.
I just like doing it. Man. Turret lasts plenty long. I probably should have killed myself with that again at some point. So what happens is, say I blind someone, it's going to give me the status effect of blind on my second skill. So when I throw the turret out, it's going to blow up and blind, but it also is an explosive. So we've messed around with that, so that's pretty fun. Um, If you haven't been watching the other videos, the turret is amazing. And the seeker mines are 10 seconds. Everything's good. Everything is pretty good. I don't feel like I have to stick my neck out to do halfway decent damage because, you know, as a skill build, you're going to be really sucking when you have to put your head up a bunch to shoot to compensate. Now, granted, you can still do that, and you probably should, of course, do that, but not so much so that you're dying all the time because you, you have to do that to get any type of decent damage. So at this point, I would say good job. Good job on this with the skills. Let me uh, show you with the flame turret because flame turret's fun too. And there is a new mod, unless it was there before and I just did never paid attention to it. And what I actually do is with this one, I'm gonna take the, it is burn strength. I've never seen that before. Maybe it was there before. I just didn't notice it. But what that'll do, and I'll show you the effect of the gloves with it. Watch how fast this kills too. Quite nice. Now when I throw out my... See the circle there? It's going to make a fire explosion and then do what it does normally. 28,000 damage, 28,000 damage. I mean, let's be real. That's what skills should do. Not tickle people. They should be hurting people. That's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome.
Got nothing bad to say about that. I mean, honestly. Alright, well this video is 10 minutes as well. I think I tested everything except the mortar turret that I really wanted to test. And I, I'm excited again. So thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. And I will be back when I figure out what else I want to test. Alright, thanks a lot. Bye.